Uh, so I started playing AFL when I was about eight years old. Um, I grew up in Canberra playing rugby uh, from about five and when I moved down to Victoria with, with my family, um, they didn't have rugby down there. Uh, Dad took me to try netball but um, I didn't really get the grasp of the no contact thing and they tried to make me wear a skirt so he took me to AFL. Um, I'd never heard of it at the time but I fell in love straight away. I just absolutely loved the contact and playing with the boys and um, I've played ever since. So I moved up to Darwin uh, at the start of last year. I wanted to be in an environment that was as challenging as possible for both footy and work to be able to push myself in sort of a different environment and have absolutely loved sort of experiencing a different league and a, a different sort of calibre of women as well. Ever since I was five years old, Mum said as long as I lived under her roof I had to wear a headgear. Um, she always struggled to see me running around on the field. She's got a, a little bit of um, degeneration of vision, uh, not by too much, but um, always sort of struggled to, to pick me up running out there on the ground with the other girls. And because um, I was always a bit of a tomboy growing up, I always refused to wear pink. And um, she said it one day, you know, if you wore a pink headgear, I might come and watch you play more. And I went out and bought one as a joke um, initially a few years ago. I was just going to wear it the once, and I haven't um, stopped wearing it since. And yeah, I absolutely love it. <laughs> Uh, so I started with Waratah for the 2015-16 season. It was amazing to see just a whole different style of footy played up here compared to um, anywhere else. I've had the opportunity to play in three or four other states and, and up here it's a whole different ball game. You know, the pace, the speed, the, the young talent coming through, especially with this national competition coming up next year. I think it'll be a great way to sort of showcase that um, and really sort of develop a new generation of female football players and also gain a fair bit of respect from um, the public in general.